adjusting brace height. You measure the brace height you've got with one of these bar squares, and this is six and a half inch, so that's ideal for an English longbow. Suppose you want a higher brace height. Unbrace the bow. Take off the bottom loop. Look at the string. The string is going like that. So if you want to raise it, you rotate it with the string. And you see these black and white rotations are tightening up. Just a couple of twists and the bow is all of a sudden way higher braced. How often can you twist the string? Uh, quite a few times. Until the moment that when unbraced it curls up. Then there's too many twists. What also happens? You create way more stretch in the string. More stretch means the initial brace height is stupidly high and then it beds in more. If you need to twist the bowstring too many times, readjust the nut. Lowering the brace height. This is now with those couple of twists, seven inches. Taking it down. If you hold it here and you rotate it, you see black and the white distance is altering and there it comes undone. Now this is important. If you unwind it too much you end up unwinding this bit with the Flemish inlay. See? You can untwist this. You can untwist this. And then this whole loop comes undone, usually second or third shot. And it's not easy to put it all back in again, especially not during a shoot. So there's a point where you cannot lower the brace height much more. You need to readjust either the knot or one of the two loops. Adjusting the brace height. 